Hello, I'm Dr. W.H. Pennywit. Welcome to another installment of at the Pennywit Center. Yesterday we talked about comfort foods. Today I want to talk a little bit about why they're so easy to get a hold of and what they do to us when we eat them. I think there's a good reason why they're called comfort foods, don't you? I think that when we eat these comfort foods, it has a certain effect on us. And I'm not just talking about on our bodies. I'm not just talking about that we have hunger pangs and we're hungry, so we eat. We are hungry, and so we do eat. But we are not hungry simply because we haven't had a sufficient amount of food. I think there's a, there's a deeper underlying reason for that. And so we turn to comfort foods. Comfort foods are never good for us like fruits or vegetables, or usually they're not. They're usually fatty things like ice cream, cheese, meats, uh, cakes, pies, cookies, candy, chocolate. The list goes on and on. Those are what comfort foods are. And they have a specific effect on our body chemicals. And that's the key. We're going to get into that a little bit tomorrow, so tune in. 